huge welcome to this video I'm scorpion from how to do and today we will be learning uh, on request of my really awesome guy how to change our third person character so this is the character I'm using now and I want to change this guy into this guy which is standing over there like uh, <laughs> a kind of a robotic thing he's a ghost we can walk through him so I want to change him and uh, change that into him so uh, yeah let's see how to do that so if you want to learn how to make all of this go ahead click the link in the description box below and see my tutorial series so uh, so I have this guy he is also fully rigged so if you want to uh, know how to rig and animate your character go ahead and click the link in the description box below and see my video tutorial on how to add bones inside your character and how to find some really awesome animations so uh, I'm going to drag uh, this guy in the position of my current character like that and there we go and then what we can do is we can go to the front view and align him like this and yeah that's pretty much it bring it down so that it's it's like that Brad now what we're gonna do is I am going to change the name so uh, like player one so because uh, this is in the player base I'm go I mean I'm continuing this uh, GTA series so if you haven't seen them go ahead click the link in the description box below because I taught everything we use in this thing all right everything so here we have uh, let me just delete that so here we have this watchdogs character it's, it is this one and I'm going to drag and drop the player one inside over here now what you want to do is you want to go to the uh, watchdogs character I am going to copy the character controller copy component and paste it over here paste component as new so you can see now our character has this uh, character controller around him and then we can copy these two uh, FSMs and paste them in here paste them as new copy the last one uh, copy component and paste component as new and then what we can do is we can uh, see that in the animator we have this animator controller it is animator tut which is mean uh, animator tutorial so we can go to where it is it's over here in my case in my animations and you have to go ahead and select your player and drag and drop your animator uh, controller inside over here make sure you say apply root motion so uh, without that the character cannot move around and then what we can do is we can select the watchdogs character go inside it and you will see these three things uh, four things uh, camera follow alert destination raycast and water detector so we have to drag and drop it inside our player one and there we go now we can disable this guy and we only have this thing appear and if I play now it, it will uh, properly work I guess it should properly work let me see there we can you can see he can walk around run around do that stuff however if I take out the gun the gun will, won't be there all right however he does that animation so everything is working quite nicely however there is no gun over here so we have to add the gun so for the gun you have to go ahead select your player uh, watchdogs character enable it again and select the gun and it is you can see in the right hand inside the gun holder so you have to go to your uh, player which you want to change and go inside the spine spine one spine two spine th uh, right right is it right uh, yeah right so right shoulder right arm right forearm and right hand so you have to drag and drop this gun holder inside your right hand just like that there we go you can see and then we can go ahead and disable that guy and and set up the gun quite so that he can grab it and I guess that's it so if I save the scene and I go inside and you will see that it will properly work if I play the game now uh, you will see that he can walk around run around he can take out the gun he is holding the gun quite nicely he can walk around with the gun aim and also shoot around however if we look up and down you can see he does not looks up and down uh, so we have to change that uh, and other thing I want to go to your uh, camera base and select the last FSM which we made and you have to change the mix more hips to your uh, original mix more hips which is this one so drag and drop your mix more hips inside over here and then you have to go to your player 
and inside your aiming if you remember we said look at the spine so he looks up and down the spine looks up and down and he can look up and down while he's aiming so we have to go ahead and select our spine and drag and drop our spine in here uh, there we go and also in the fire one so uh, drag and drop your spine inside over here so that's pretty much it guys if you see now we can do everything we want so we can run around walk around take out the gun we can look up and down like that and we can also shoot around so there's the bullet and then we can get inside the the water he will do the swimming and there we go that's pretty much it guys hope you guys enjoyed and i will see you in my next video and uh, for you guys this is the last uh, tutorial on gta series so our gta series have actually ended and now i am going to launch a tutorial series on how to make a top down game in unity using playmaker so uh, make sure you see that tutorial series because that's really cool and yeah hope you guys enjoyed and i will see you in my next video till then be cool